It's time for baseball on MLB Network. We've got baseball on the 4th of July between the Philadelphia Phillies and the Seattle Mariners. And that'll bring up Gene Segura. And we are ready for some daytime baseball. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Into center field, line drive base hit. Batting second, the left field, number 22. And perhaps and sensing a hit and run may be on, a move to first. And the runner back. Standing in now, Andrew McCutcheon. Now he extends nicely, and this ball is driven to right field and deep. But he's going to haul this one in on the run as he winds up just shy of the wall for the first out. And Bryce Harper will dig in at the plate. He also had three hits in the win last night. Here's the one and one delivery. Hard on the ground toward short to Gordon for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. And here's the speedster D. Gordon. It'll leave things off here in the bottom half of the first. A 1 1. Hit out toward second. Kingery's there. Throw to first is in time for the first out. Malik Smith, the next to hit. He brings an average in the 260s into this one. Now the one and one pitch. Is swung on and missed, and that's strike two. Romero is coming off a win in his last start, the first of his major league career, so I'm sure he's still riding high from that achievement. Slap hard the opposite way. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Into the box now. Mitch Henniger lifted in the air toward the line and right. And that'll get over the wall. So forget about sending the runner. It'll be second and third now with only one away. To the plate now. Daniel Vogelback. And this is sent on the ground out to Segura at short. Only play will be to first as we'll see our first run score here as this is a 1 0 that ball game. The third baseman at the plate, Kyle, Kyle Seeger. And the Mariners Seager. trying to make this first inning even bigger here. Here's the 3 1. There's a swing and a high deep drive headed for the right field corner. But this one will bend foul. Had plenty of distance though as it landed in the upper deck. That's lifted the other way out to left. McCutcheon is under it. And that ends the inning. All set for the start of the inning. And next to bat will be the first baseman, Reese Hoskins. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. Hit in the air down the right field line. On the run is Henniger, and it's a foul ball. The 2 2 one more time. Ball, no. ball three. Three and two now. These are the kind of ABs, regardless of the outcome, you go back to the dugout as an offensive player, and your teammates are loving on you for making that pitcher work and battling it out. The three two one more time. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Ranging back is Henniger. He's around first heading for two. And a high bounce will take it over the outfield wall and he kicks off the inning with a ground rule double. At the plate now. Didi Gregorius hit in the air out to left field. Nola is right there as he puts it away. No problem for the first down. At the plate, JT Realmuto, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. The 
2 1 home. Two balls and two strikes now. Here now the 2 2 is taken ball three. Looked to me like he tried to do way too much on that 2 2 pitch. You don't have to come into the zone on that count, but a pitch that far outside isn't going to tempt anyone to swing. And whoa, awfully close, but it's ball four, according to Woody Keller. The designated hitter, Nick Williams. Now he gets the ground ball to first. This might be two. One there. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And next to hit is the catcher, Tom Murphy. Popped him up. Gregorius in foul ground. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Digging in, Patrick Wisdom. He'll get to take his first cuts here. The 1-1. One, one. Down the third baseline. But this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. The 1-2 is taken for ball two. Hey, struggling to find the release point of that curveball. That wasn't a very good one. Somehow he's just got to find that field because that's a pitch he's going to need going forward. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. No Bases are empty okay. here with two men out. Late making contact on that swing, and we'll do it again on one and two. And that pitch misses to even the count to the Seattle left fielder at two and two. And he misses this one inside and that'll run things full three and two. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. And this one misses high for ball four and they have themselves a two out base runner. Stepping up now Tim Lopes and at first after the two out walk. Line towards center field. A dive, but it's off his glove. The batter, the batter, the batter. In now, D. Gordon. D. Line toward the alley in left center. That's in there. Base hit. And not in time as the second run scores. So now to the plate, Malik Smith hit down the third baseline. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. From the belt, kicks and deals. Now a foul tip held onto behind the plate at strike three, and that ends the inning. Standing in, Adam Hazley. First shot for him here. Two hits in five trips a night ago. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Batting nine. The second baseman. Scott Kingery. Standing in now, Scott Kingery. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Hit back up the middle. And that finds its way through for a base hit. Now back. The football. Into the box. Gene Segura. And well off the plate with the change of pace. That's ball two. A time to start making some quality pitches. He finds himself in a tough spot behind an account with guys on base. So Gordon for one. On to first, and they turn the double play. So the next hitter to dig in will be Andrew McCutcheon. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. The 2-1 home. Smoked on the ground left side. A dive, and he knocks it down. 
And the recovery will not be in time at first, and the inning will continue following the infield single. For Philadelphia, the right fielder, Bryce Harper. Stepping in now, Bryce Harper. But this will be pulled in out there at second base, and that'll be that. Bottom of the inning now, and digging in is the outfielder, Mitch Hanniger. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. McCutcheon is under it. And that's the first out of the inning. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Daniel Vogelback. Turned on down the line. But this will wind up a foul ball. Two and two. The pitch. Third inning here. Three to one our score. Popped him up. Gregorius trying to get there. And he tracks it down. A nice running play to record the second out. At the plate, Kyle Seeger. He flew out in his last at bat. Here's the one and two delivery. High in the air out to center field. Hazley is camped under this one. And he will make the catch, so that'll do it. New inning set to get underway, and that'll bring up Reese Hoskins. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right. A swing by Hoskins, and this is driven to deep left. Gone to lead off the inning. To the plate now, Didi Gregorius. A ball and two strikes to Didi Gregorius. One, two is an off speed pitch. No dice. It's two and two. Here's the pitch. Grounder hit hard down the first baseline. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Now Digging back. in now for Philadelphia. JT Realmuto. He drew a base on balls his first time up. 1-1. One, one. Taken. Strike two. Seared down the first baseline. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. Two balls and two strikes to the Phillies catcher. And that one never threatened the zone. It's gone full now to three and two. That was kind of a gift to the hitter. He's up there probably thinking of protecting on two and two. But when you launch a ball that high out of the strike zone, it's obviously easy to take that one. Nick set here comes the 1 1 there's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field he leaps but he can't get it it's down for extra bases and they'll have runners at second and third following the one out double now batting the center fielder Adam Hazley. at the plate Adam Hazley that's in there and it'll run the count to full three and two Got to think he was sitting fastball right there to let that hanger go by. He won't see that pitch again the rest of the season. Line towards center field. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And that lead disappears with it as this is now a 3-3 ball game. Now that And in steps Scott Kingery. Runner in scoring position with Sugan. Rounded back up the middle. Reined in. Off balance throw. Gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And next will be the power hitting catcher, Tom Murphy. 
Now the 2 1. Hard liner to center field. Hazley is right there, one down. Stepping now in, Patrick Wisdom. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Bases are empty, one man out. Two balls and a strike to the Mariners' first baseman. Man, that's a great take right there. Backdoor slider just missed the outside corner. This guy must have a really good eye. Most guys swing at that pitch. Harper on the run. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Ready for another chance? Austin Nova. He drew a walk his first time up. Three runs, four hits, and no errors in the game for the Mariners to this point. Fastball is taken for a strike, and he runs it full three and two. Oh, this is hit high and deep out to left. And that ball gets down out near the wall and should be extra bases. And he'll coast into second here with a two-out double. The bat, the here. In now, Tim Lopes. That's ball two as the slider dips below the zone. Good time to be a nine-hole hitter right now. More than likely going to get a good pitch to hit. The top of the order is looming. And this gets right through him, and that may be a run. And not in time as the run scores. As he arrives at second without a play, as they jump ahead with a run scoring on the play. Second baseman, D. Into the box now, D. Gordon. Hit on the ground to short. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Ready to go in the top of the fifth. And that'll bring in the middle infielder, Gene Segura. The 3 1. Finds the zone to fill the count, 3 and 2. And a good eye here as he takes ball four, and it's a base on balls to lead off the fifth inning. Here's Andrew McCutcheon now. A hit in two tries so far. Oh, and there's a drive to deep left center. You can pretty much forget about this one. This is way out of here. Eric Swanson will come on to make his 40th appearance this season. Number 50. Eric Swanson. Standing in now, Bryce Harper. And this ball runs away for ball two. Two and one. And he misses again. Ball three. They know the threat this guy possesses at the plate. I know it's 3-1 in this situation right here, but I can't imagine anything comes over the heart of the plate. And there's his first base hit in this one. The first base of the 17th. Into the box, Reese Hoskins. One and two. This pitcher's bringing it with some high velo. You better get that front foot down early and get ready, or he's going to throw it right by you. A bouncer to the left side, scooped up. The second for one. On to first, and they get the double play. Digging in once again, Didi Gregorius. He was a ground out victim last time up. Hitters count now. Here's the two and one. And that's ball three now as it just misses below the zone. JT Real Muto would be next if they can keep this inning alive. High and deep down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. Now the three and two pitch. It's the top of the zone. He struck him out looking. Set now for the bottom of the fifth, and that'll bring up the speedy outfielder, Malik Smith. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. Sent on the ground out to second. Kingery's there, and that's the first out. 
Digging in now for the Mariners. Mitch Henniger, one for two, including a double back in the first. Maybe too much break on the slider. Two and one. Sitting in a good spot right here. Two ball, one strike count is yet to see a fastball. Have to be sitting on one right here. That's in for a base hit, and he's two for three. So now to the plate, Daniel Vogelback. And he gets him to wave at that one. It's two and two. Three and two, a full count to the Mariners' designated hitter. Not a bad time right here to put that runner in motion. Three, two count. You send the runner, and if it's a bad pitch, it's ball four. Now the payoff pitch home. Gets him looking, strike three. So a runner at first with two away. And into bed next, the third baseman, Kyle Seeger. Seeger. High in the air out to center field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Top half of the sixth about to get started, and that brings up JT Realmuto. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Now the pitch. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. One out for the Phils in their half of the sixth, and digging into the plate, the Texas native Nick Williams. 1 1. High in the air into shallow left center. Nola comes on and makes the catch in shallow left for out number two. Digging in to try it again, Adam Hazley. He lined out in his last trip, so looking for better fortunes here. Yeah, Matty, but as he walks to the plate right here, he feels good building off that. And he grooves the fastball there. This is hit high and deep out to straightaway center field. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will end the inning. Nick Pavetta enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 43. Nick. Now with the play, Tom Murphy. His career numbers in this matchup. He's one for two. The 2-1. Two Loud contact there, but it's well fouled. Into the windup. Here comes the 2-2 pitch. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Center fielder giving chase. He's there and records the first out. So digging in now, Patrick Wisdom. He struck out and flied out. 0 for 2 so far. The 1-1. One, one. Swung on and missed for strike number 2. I think it's about time to choke up on that bat and get that foot down. He's awfully tardy right now. And it's two balls and two strikes now. He's ready with the 2-2 pitch. Won't commit on the slider. Good patience and it's full 3-2. Austin Nola, the number eight hitter here, waits on deck. And that's into the outfield for a one-out base hit. Stepping in now, Austin Nola. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Fouled off. Now a move over to first, and he'll dive back in safely. Wisdom, base runner at first with one out. Hit the other way out toward right field. Harper is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Coming to the plate now, Tim Lopes. A couple of singles to his credit thus far. Line drive to center field. Hazley is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Know, 
seventh inning ready to roll and that'll bring in the second baseman Scott Kingery. And a good bite to that slider as he swings through it for the first out of the inning. Gene Segura standing in one for two in the ball game thus far. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right and that'll move the count to one and two now. Softly hit to short. And an off balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. So two are gone now in the Philadelphia seventh and that'll bring up the former National League MVP Andrew McCutcheon. Well, you don't see this very often, Matty V, a two-strike straight changeup. But this guy changeup is one of the best in the league. We'll see if he tries that different approach. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Sir Anthony Dominguez gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. Number 58. The last half of the seventh here, and up next is Speedy D. Gordon. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. Runs up and gets this one down. And a wise decision there to make sure this ball stays foul, and that's the second strike. He's ready with the 2-2 pitch. Ball three. When you're playing close games like this, base runners mean everything, so he can ill afford to start giving away free passes. High and deep down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. So here's Malik Smith. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. The 1-1 home. This is line to left, but pretty much right at the left fielder as he takes it in for the second out. Mitch Hanniger the next to bat. He's two for three and looking for more here. And he lays off for a ball, two and one. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch. But if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. Three and one to him now. Now Hanniger with a drive. That one's hit well to deep left field. That one is out of here. This game is tied. At the plate, Daniel Vogelback. Bounce it to the left side, but the inning will continue as that's through for a two-out hit. And this will get all the way to the wall now. And he's able to hustle his way up the second as he'll reach here with a two-base hit. Now batting, the third baseman, Kyle And it looks like they'd rather go after the next guy as the intentional walk signal comes here with two away. Digging in now, Tom Murphy. Two outs and two runners aboard here in the seventh inning. The set and the 2-2. Two -two. And that misses, so it's a full count, three and two. For the guy in the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. Fouled away. To short. On to first, and this will remain a tie ball game as the inning is over. Taylor Gilbo has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 45. Into the box now, Bryce Harper. He's coming off a month in which he earned National League Player of the Month recognition. Squared that one up just a little late. Wait. 
Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Next to bat will be Reese Hoskins. There's the fastball that gets the lower part of the zone called for a strike. That's the exact spot to lean on as a reliever. As a hitter, you just have to tip your cap and look for the next one. And there are two away now. Here's Didi Gregorius. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. The set and the 3-1 pitch. And he lays off. Ball four. Now the potential go-ahead run is on base here. Now time is called and we'll have a pinch runner at first. And that'll be a wise decision as he's the potential go-ahead run. Now in the box, JT Real Muto. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. And he misses with it, ball four. So the potential go ahead run moves into scoring position now. Big spot here. First and second, two men gone. And digging in at the plate, the Texas native Nick Williams. Weak grounder down the first baseline. Fielded cleanly. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Victor Arano is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 64, Victor Arano. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. And here comes the first baseman, Patrick Wisdom. And the slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Arano has over 40 innings on his line so far. And when you look at his whip over those innings, it's not a particularly pretty number. Over 1.5, so he's often dealing with a lot of traffic on the base pads, unfortunately. 3-1 pitch is a slider, and he can't pull the trigger. It's 3-2 and two now. He lays off ball four. Now the potential go ahead run is on base here. Settling in now, Austin Nova. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. He's set. Here's the three and two. Oh, it's on the ground to second. Did he get his double play? Segura for one on the first. And you can forget about the go ahead run being on base. He's erased on the double play. Here. So base is empty now after the double play. And coming forward now is the shortstop, Tim Lopes. The set and the 1-1. One, one. Up high, 2-1 and one now. And it misses, 3-1 and one now. Well, he really needs to make this guy swing the bat right here. He's not the type of hitter you want to dance around with. And he lays off. Ball four. Now the potential go-ahead run is on base here. So back to the top of the Seattle lineup. Digging in. D. Gordon. And we'll see if they can make him pay for the two-out walk. Always considered a big no-no, of course. Lofted in the air out toward right center. On the move is Harper. He makes the catch. What a play on the run to end the inning. Yoshihisa Hirano will be on the mound to start the ninth inning, and his job will be keeping the ball game tied until the bottom half. All set to start the ninth in this one, and next to bat will be the outfielder, Adam Hazley. Helping him out here as he swings and misses to fall behind a ball in two strikes. That's just a great pitch right there, great execution. He just got that hitter to think that pitch was knee-high. Nasty diving out of the zone. So he chased out of the strike zone on that one. Adam Hazley becomes the first out of the inning. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. Can't find the zone there, and it's three and one. It'd be great right here if he was able to work himself on base. You got the leadoff hitter on deck, and you know the middle of the order is coming up right behind him. And he lays off. Ball four. Now the potential go-ahead run is on base here. Hit down the line at first. 
But a foul ball, one and two now. And this is pulled fouled as he was way out in front there. Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. Man, this guy's a grinder. Fouls off good pitches and doesn't seem to swing at the ones just off the corner. This guy's a pitcher's nightmare. Here's the 2-2 pitch. Line toward the gap in left center. And that finds a seam for extra bases as we'll see if they want to wheel that go-ahead run home from first. Oh, and the throw back in is a wild one. Now back, left field, Andrew McCutcheon. In now, Andrew McCutcheon. Grounder down the line at third. But this is going to be a foul ball as that keeps things at two and two. Ready with another two strike offering back up the middle and through into center field a base hit Segura is on his way home and he's safe at the plate and they take a seven to five lead. Into the box now Bryce Harper pitch misses low the throw down and they will not get McCutcheon here he's in safely at second base. Now the 2-1. Fastball swung on and grounded out towards second. Gordon is there, and that's the second out. So a big moment in the ball game here. Reese Hoskins, although there are a couple of bases open, and we'll see if they think about working around him. Ready with two balls and a strike. Ball even at 2-2. Two and two. So a full count now. Count is full. Now on three and two as a pitcher, you've got to go with the pitch that you feel most comfortable throwing with. And he struck him out. So a good pitch there, and now they're going to need to string some hits together in this last at-bat if they want to get back in this thing. David Robertson comes on looking for a save here in the bottom of the ninth inning. Number 30, David Leading off the inning, Malik Smith, and they'll need him to get something going here. And that is the start they were looking for down by two as that misses for ball four. Stepping in now is Mitch Hanniger, and he's got a shot at history here, but he'll need a triple to complete the cycle. Yeah, that last at bat, Daddy, he turned that fastball around. He didn't hit it a ton. He didn't hit it a country mile. But, hey, listen, a home run is a home run. Harper will settle under it to make the play for the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Number Dan Vogelbach is next. He doubled his last time through. Yeah, he did a great job to go down and get that one his last at bat. But I got to think they're going to pitch him up, maybe elevate something in the zone. Interested to see how he approaches this next A.B. Harper is over to his right as he puts this one away. Two down. Here's the third baseman now, Kyle now Seeger. Back. And he needs the to make something baseman. happen. They're down to their Kyle. final out here in the ninth. Seeger. 1-1. One, one. Ball. 2-1. Slider misses and he's in danger of losing him here three and one time to narrow your focus up there at the plate in a one run game. He doesn't want to walk it. So there's a good chance he's going to get something to handle right here. And that misses ball four. So it's first and second now with two out. And that'll bring in Tom Murphy struggling so far in this one and looking to erase his 0 for 4 ball game right here. And this is swung on and missed. So with that, they find themselves down to their final strike here this afternoon. Last chance for the Mariners. 1-2 is the cut fastball, but he holds back 2-2. Two two. Great take right there, but the last thing you want to do is be called out on strikes to end the game. Fly ball out toward left center field. McCutcheon is under it. 
Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. Hey, it's hard to win games at any point, but to win games on the road, especially in this ballpark, so they are very happy with this win. 7-5 to five how today's comes to an end. The Philadelphia Phillies came through when it mattered in the ninth on the way to the win. Victor Arano gets the win in relief his second of the year. David Robertson wraps it up for the save his 16th of the season. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney down on the field, and the rest of our crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. Thanks for watching MLB Network. Our final line score this afternoon. First for the victorious Philadelphia Phillies. Seven runs, 11 hits. No errors. They left eight men on base. For the Mariners, five runs, 10 hits. No errors. They left 10 men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 32 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this afternoon. And we remind you to please drive home safely.